Well, we are, as you know well, uh, participating at this exhibition continuously since 2004. Uh, we are also developer and producers of complex weapon systems, so some kind of ammunition. We are producing uh, several types of products. First of all, it's ammunition. Also, we are producing uh, combat vehicles, as you know well, those actually Lazar Miller's combat vehicles, new line products from, let's say, recent de decades. Also, the, uh, the artillery systems like um, Tau artillery and uh, also the speaking about the rocket artillery. We're also investing in the, uh, uh, in the families of uh, missile launchers and missile systems with missiles, anti tank missiles, ground to ground missiles of the different ranges, uh, and of, of course, the families of modern loitering weapons, including uh, modern, the, the Raven long-range loitering weapon. Uh, the Nora is the flagship of, of uh, Yugo Imports and even Serbian defense products. Good starting point for the new weapon development. Uh, we can make the new weapon in early 2000 uh, based on integration of fully automatic gun loading mechanism. Before that, uh, in the for pure artillery weapon point of view, we had made the modern NATO standard uh, 155 ammunition uh, with a cell sealing combusted, combusted ch chamber with cell sealing mechanism uh, in the backs or in the uh, so-called monoblock configuration with nitrocellulose paper. It is solid configuration. This weapon has been practically our very good, uh, actually, the, the ticket for international market. And it, we practically enter in the global players in artillery and all, not only artillery but also in the modern scale of defense systems. Now we have an Nora NG, uh, new generation weapon, uh, which has a lot of features, but uh, one feature is most important. It is uh, the new generation of uh, modernized uh, gun loading mechanism, uh, which can accept uh, the 30 rounds uh, with ability for uh, also the slightly higher actually rate of fire and also with also the very modern fire control system integration uh, providing for even uh, a better uh, shoot and scoot capability with uh, lower than before marching to, to, to firing position time and vice versa. The armor cabin is uh, similar as like uh, Ednora B9M21 uh, which has been based off man chests. The Nora NG has the cabin for five persons inside because now uh, this, uh, the practically firing module is fully integrated remote control firing module containing 30 rounds ready for fire, uh, reaching about three to four uh, rounds per minute. The first model weapon which we had made in Serbia, it was uh, Morava. It was actually a medium sized model weapon with very precision, practically the eye aiming system, providing very okay, accuracy of the target and also very short uh, transmission time. Based on this uh, technolo those technologies, we import practically uh, invested for making, let's say, let's say the popular full size or, or, or heavy eight by eight truck chassis based modular system. We are speaking about platform with appropriate crane which can accept uh, any type of rockets. And of course, we can put uh, different types of containers with uh, uh, launching tubes made from composite and aluminum and steel comp composite, providing for uh, launching of a single or even a multiple multiple use containers. In caliber two, one to two, has the ability for launching of uh, 48 rockets in one salvo, plus 48 in the platform. Even now, we are developing new containers uh, with 60, 60 rockets. It could be provided the ability for launching 120 rockets from Ansalvo and 120 platform. We also finally developing 262 rocket range, 70 kilometers. This launcher uh, can launch uh, the, some kind of bigger rockets, let's say two or four even rockets. As you can see, I have seen 
the Sumadia type of rocket launchers. Also, finally, Tamnava will launch a slick model organ at the ALAS missile system. ALAS missile system uh, is uh, just now entering in, in production, serial production for our armed forces and for abroad. Uh, it is uh, 175 millimeter caliber, uh, the missile system with fiber optical guidance, guidance system with uh, range of 25 kilometers with also optional radio data link as like for more giving more more better flexibility and reliability of this system we also de developing now got the raven govern loitering weapon the raven has the range of 50 kilometers with standard electri electrical engine uh, with uh, radio data link with uh, worked uh, high explosive anti tank penetrating 1000 millimeter of rocket missile armor and also has ability for lighting with infrared or TV or TV homing temp homing heads. We are developing those side by eight vehicles since 2008. We had made the first prototype for let's say technological demonstrator of eight by eight laser, but laser free uh, has been practically entering the production in 2015. Let's say something like we had developed in 2000, 2013. This vehicle has also ability of MRAP. It was produced for our armed forces in, in huge number, also for our gendarmeria. And now we are producing new laser free M. And this weapon, this vehicle is integrated with uh, remote control weapon station with 30 meter caliber. Protection level is, is good for those vehicles, uh, providing for our very good uh, using of high, actually, eff efficiency steel plates and also combined armor with um, multi-layer armor made, made of standards of, of course, uh, the steel plates and modular steel, steel modular armor. Also, the Milos and Milos 2 vehicles are family of uh, modern tactical armor multi-role vehicle, which has ability for, for carrying of eight men for the Milos. Now we are developing the new Milos 2 vehicle just entering production with 10, practically two more person in the dismount infantry of the squad. Milos 2 is also slightly bigger, uh, has slightly uh, bigger axles uh, with total weight of 18 tons, comparing 14 tons in first one. Those four tons difference we are using for increasing arm protection, increasing the weapon system. Also, we have Lazansky vehicle, very modern with a very wide uh, wide range of armor protection with a possibility of protection level of four, five, uh, six or five. It has 36 tons, uh, actually, the actual capacity, also with a uh, much more heavier weapon. The, definitely, uh, we are ready, and the demands for artillery ammunition and also the rocket ammunition are very high at all global worlds. According to the experiences, uh, in those artillery ammunition is something like uh, very important in battlefield, still, still very important for different, of course, combat scenarios. Independently of high development of, um, of modern weapon systems, uh, guided missiles, etc., those ammunition is still very, very uh, attractive.